Before the world had form, two deities, a Zangani and a Zanganai, stood at the gateway of the heavens. Looking down, they thrust their jeweled spear. Upon withdrawing it, drips of brine collected at its tip, falling back down into the swirling mists below, forming the islands now known as the Japans. And so it was, according to the Nihon Shoki, the ancient chronicles of Japan. It's fascinating myth and mythology that is presented in better understanding a culture far from here. And so too, like the ancient chronicles of Japan, so too does Okinawa during the old Rukyu kingdom also have a secret book of knowledge regarding our tradition of Karatego. It is called the Bubishi. Hi, my name is Patrick McCarthy. And it's a pleasure to bring this presentation to you today regarding the practices of the Bubishi. And now what I'd like to talk about is just, which is, I just want to walk you through the exercise and talk about the, some of the techniques that we're going to do, okay? All right, so we've come up and we've brought these hands up into this position. You see, it's kind of like if you were, say, uh, someone who understood uh, Sanshin, for example, you know how you bring your hands out, you notice there's that, like, that V kind of configuration. We refer to this as the hourglass. I'll talk to you about bridging, uh, checking and bridging later, but for the time being, all we're doing is we're bringing the hands straight up like this from here. You see how on the side is we're bringing them straight up like this from here. Big inhalation and then we're, we're rotating, rotating the bridge or rotating the palm.